Okay, so what we have here is the Bunsen burner. Uh, in the Bunsen burner, you're going to need matches. You need to want, make, want to make sure that it's sitting on a secure surface, just like it is here. When adjusting the Bunsen burner, you want to take the valve on the bottom, which is for the amount of gas, turn it all the way to clockwise, and then turn it about a half a turn counterclockwise and set it back down. The barrel is also adjustable, so you're going to tighten that all the way clockwise until it stops, and that's all you have to do. Just make sure it's snug. Okay, now it's time to light it. Okay. The other end of the Brunson burner is attached to a gas jet on, next to the sink. The valve that is used to control the gas is perpendicular to the gas jet when it's off, but when it's parallel like this, it's on. That's off. That's on. This is also off. This is on. This is off. So adjusting the gas, only adjust it to all on or all off. The next thing you need to do is to light the Bunsen burner. So you're going to take and strike your match first to get it to light. Strike on the side of the box. And then turn your gas on. Turn it all the way on. Run the match up the side, and voila, you should have a flame. Blow out the match and set it aside. Now you now now you need to adjust the flame. So if you turn the barrel counterclockwise, that part is not going to be hot until you get a nice blue pointy flame. Okay, you may have to adjust the gas a little bit to turn it down or up, but until you get a nice pointy blue flame. You can kind of see it up against the background, a nice blue flame. That's little, that is the way you need to light the Bunsen burner. That's it.